Hey, what's going on, assholes? My name is Joe. I've been uh, playing hockey since, um, ooh, gosh, for about eight years now. Um, I played varsity hockey for my high school, my junior, my senior year, and actually right now I'm working as a referee, uh, a hockey referee as my job. That's how I make my money. So uh, I know a lot about this game, uh, and this company called uh, Japan uh, just decided to release a hockey anime, so I figured I'd uh, give it a look. So um, the first thing I'm noticing is that this is a uh, woman's hockey which is not particularly well known for being all that interesting <laughs> they are unfortunately not allowed to hit there no checking is allowed in women's hockey which is like really fucking boring it, that's like the it's like the most fun thing about this sport when i played hockey i was terrible with the puck and my the bit the thing i was the best at was going up to people and just fucking hitting them that was my best thing and so they basically have removed me from ever being in this show. So that's uh, that's minus points for them. It sucks for them. So this is the Hockey World Cup. Japan versus Canada. This is an actual thing that happened. Um, I'm pretty sure Japan wound up winning. I like the way they animate this. It's cool. There's a lot less uh, swearing than I'm used to in a typical hockey game. And a lot less yelling from the coach. My coach was so fucking loud. And uh, holy shit. These fucking stands are packed. I have seen avalanche hockey games with less people than this. Jesus Christ. Okay, very good block by the goalie there. Insane. Yeah, you see them just like kind of pushing each other. If someone has the ice in like uh, in regular hockey, hold, they are they are fucking dead. They blow them up. The big pass, the cross ice pass. No one's covering her. Who's covering her? Okay, big slap shot, one timer. She took a slap shot and it went exactly one millimeter off the ice. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, okay. Um, so she, I refuse to believe that. She scored five hole. Okay, five hole is the place between the goalie's legs. She scores five hole on a, on a Canadian goalie in the World Cup from center ice straight ahead with no one screening the goalie. That I refuse to believe. <laughs> they did it. You're actually not allowed to take your helmets off. Um, you're n unfortunately, if I'm the ref there, I'm just, I'm blowing the whistle at them. I'm telling them put your helmets back on. And God has officially left us. So if I have this correct, they won the hockey tournament, cha showered, changed into different clothes. Got back on the ice, which was, uh, I assume it was zammed. Uh, and then now they are holding a music dance concert on the ice. Is this satire? Am I missing the satire here? Why is there only seven players on their team? Wait, there's no car- they're just dancing on the ice. What? There's no carpet. Do they not know how ice works? They're gonna- There's no- Do their boots have spikes in them? What is going on? It's still going- She's just dancing straight on the ice. How is this possible? This is this is satire, right? And I'm missing it. This is satire. They learned to skate in gym class? What the fuck kind of rich ass school are these kids going to where they have an ice rink in their school? Is it was it just fucking underneath the tennis court? Uh, so I think they don't like they're like they're much older uh, or much younger than the original clips. So I, I think they're trying to get me to believe that these guys became world champions uh, in like under two years. On my hockey team, I was the one who had been playing for the least amount of time, and I had been doing it for seven years. Everyone else on my hockey team had been doing it for over ten years. So for them to go in two years and become world champions and beat Canada, the guys who invented hockey, I just don't know. Yeah, and girls hockey body checking is an illegal hit, so... Okay, that's actually real. That's actually... I also uh, volunteer every Saturday morning to teach, like, young kids how to skate, and that's actually something we do. We call those swizzles. In youth hockey, it's actually 17 minutes um, for their age range. It's hockey, Johnny. Since when are the rules? Yeah, that happens all the time. It's so funny when little kids do that. Okay, that's fake. So when new hockey players start playing, they always... And I mean always, they put way too much weight on their stick, and if anything touches it, they fall right over. So yeah, this is this is not real. 
Also, to catch a puck that well for your very first time is not real. There's no way. Uh, final thoughts. That was terrible. <laughs> I, I don't, I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure who their target audience is. It can't be hockey players because I'm pretty sure I'm the only hockey player in the world who's ever watched an anime. And if this was the first one that I watched, I'd probably be, be pretty fucking creeped out, to be honest. <laughs> Uh, so I guess it's people who watch anime, who kind of like hockey, who are maybe thinking of getting into it, and this is gonna be the last push, which is a fucking very small bunch of people. I really don't want to watch episode two. If this gets, if this gets a thousand likes, I'll watch episode two.